All right, guys, we're back into some dragon quests. Um, oh, I didn't want to talk to you. Thank you uh, so much for Square Enix for providing me a copy. This is um, really nice of them to do it. Katie, more dragon quests, indeed. What are you doing, Perry? Can I ask what you're doing here? This is really awkward, dude. You're making us all feel weird. All right, let's talk to the hairy hermit. Uh, you're back, 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 and I see you've brought a few new friends with you. Oh, who's this lovely lady? Her beauty is making me bash, bash, bashful. A flattery will get you nowhere, Mr. Hermit. We prefer our gentlemen with hairy chins, not hairy backs. Wow. Are you the hairy hermit we've heard so much about? We've come to live here, if that's all right with you. <laughs> it's more than all right, young lady. I'd be off my rock, rock, rocker to say no. I imagine the first thing you'll need is a place to stay, stay, stay. Now, where can we put you? Thanks for the offer, but we don't need our houses or hotels just yet. There's something else I want to build first. You remember when I got turned into stone? Well, that meant you built the gold bar without me. I missed out a big time there. To make up for it, I want to build a great big building. Something proper special, what people will see from miles come around, or from miles around will come and see. That sounds like a wonderful idea, Babs. I was just thinking that Lulutopia could do with the premium tourist attraction. Oh, in that case, I know just the spot where you can put it, the Scarlet Sands. Why don't you head east and check it, uh, check, check, check out the island's second stone tablet? Sweet. Alright, so I just learned, um, I was watching Wander stream last night, and I just learned that if I go into miscellaneous, or maybe the Builderpedia? Items. If I go through here, I can purchase items using, um, gratitude. I don't know how to do that yet. But now that I know that, I feel like I'm going to be using that a lot more. Because <laughs> uh, earlier I was like, where the hell can I get more cotton? And then I realized, oh, you could probably just give you gratitude. Because I have, I have like so much gratitude all the time. All right. Let's see how many min uh, minerals I can use. End game possibly? Not yet? Okay. Because I was like, Dude, cotton's so hard to come by. Why can't I get more cotton? If I could just trade in some of this gratitude, I would be... It would be lovely. Oh, look at that. I got more music. I got so much music. I got a mustache! If I get three more medals, I'll get something better. Okay, cool. Alright, so we gotta head this way? Let's go this way. Yep. I'll go, guys. Ooh, the Scarlet Sands. Whee! Sweet. That's post-game. Okay. Alright. Looking at this stone table. Just like the tat-tat tablet in the Green Gardens, this too was left, left, left behind by a builder who lived here once upon a time. Think carefully about what you need to build. To turn this place into your own island paradise. When it comes to con conclusions, the targets will appear. Hmm. I, I, didn't Babs want something particular? Shouldn't we ask her? Well, Babs wanted a big building, and I was hoping for some sort of scenic spot to turn the tourist attraction. Jazzy, perhaps you can think of something that combines both your ideas? You did so well before. I'm sure you could dream up something just as spectacular this time. Pictures of an enormous edifice soaring over the sand sea interspeed with Oasis Shimmer in Jazzy's mind. Yeah, everybody but Malroth gets one, yeah. Are we building a pyramid? Oh shit, we're building a pyramid in an oasis? That sounds so nice. We're going to build a pyramid in an oasis? Nice one, that sounds just like the ticket for us crumbled onions. What's a pyramid? Like some kind of giant spike? Maybe when we're done here we can throw Lulu on top. Shit. I like a look at this place. The sand, the cactuses, the red rock, it all reminds me of home. Let's not stop at a pyramid. Let's build a whole new town there. Y'all seem keen, awfully keen to get started. Are you always as excited about building? Of course, dear. Ever since we met Jazzy, we've been uh, crazy for construction. Must build more. More! Speaking of which, we must. Uh, we brung some materials with us from Grumbledown. Thought they might come in useful once we get here. You know what I mean? 
that was dark about Lulu. It, yeah, a little bit. I don't disagree because Lulu is kind of a bee. Uh, and we picked the very best uh, what off the island has to offer. If you want to use some of what we brung, just have a butcher's in that chest. Gosh, you really thought of everything. Now listen to me, everyone. Wood working, boo to shrink shirking. That's our motto here in the Lutopia. Let's all start working on this pyramid and the oasis. <laughs> you agree, but wow. I mean, Malroth is not shy of saying how much he hates Lulu. While you were away on Crumbledum, I took it upon myself to study the island a little more. I think I know the perfect place to put our tourist spot. Oh ho ho, you'd be wise to follow Lulu's lead. When work work working on the Scarlet Sand, she knows the area well. Take a look, look, look around, and don't worry about getting lost, lost, lost. Now that you've uh, activated the tablet, you can work back to it any time. We're busy down, down, down here. I'll be at the temple. P -p Pay me a visit when you've completed the tablet targets. All right. So we're going to build a pyramid right there. While the space, I could have uh, made a proper prestigious pyramid. Digsby is definitely a pyramid. We can call it. Nah, mate, we're going to name the big boy after the biggest boy around. Me, the Great Pyramid of the Diamond Geezer. Those two are stark raving bonkers, but at least they're enthusiastic. Chazzy, Ma, shall we join them? Okay, let me open this up. Woo-wee, I got me some metals. Love it. Out of here. Join them in the madness. That. There we go. So we're gonna make a giant pyramid right here. It's crazy. Here we are. It's the perfect place for a pyramid, wouldn't you agree? You played a blinder here, Lulu. I couldn't have picked a better spot myself. So are you gonna get stuck in the uh, stuck in and help us build? I certainly am. I may be the queen of Lulutopia, but I don't mind getting my hands dirty. I'm a builder too. I'll have you know. Oh, and Malroth, I have a special job for you. We'll need your strength for this project, so no lingering on the sidelines this time. <laughs> no problem. If you need me to break some blocks or maul some monsters, I'm your man. Mm. I'm glad to hear it. I expect you to work until you drop in order to uh, turn the Lutopia into a paradise it deserves to be. Uh, I think you mean my empire of visceration. <laughs> God, they're so angry at each other. Well, there's where the bleeding heck did they come from? Oh, it's those dudes. Don't have a cow, man. We're just here to watch the builder do the do. If we miss the chance, it'd be a shame, man. You won't even notice we're here, man. Carry on with your pan plan, man. Don't worry. If they stop uh, step out of line, I'll beat them senseless. You just try to concentrate on building the pyramid, okay? I like how these guys are just hanging out. Well, then I say it's high time we started working on the pyramid. Hang about. We ain't got a blueprint yet. Reckon you can do the honors, Jazzy? Make it massive, yeah? I want to build the biggest building what's ever been built. It's not suspicious at all. Not even a little. Holy shit. That's huge. Oh my god. That is so big! Oh my god. Thank god these guys are doing most of the work. That's what I call a blueprint. I know I said I wanted to be big, but I never expected more than this. We'll have a proper eye-catching pyramid when we're done. Hey, about this ain't finished yet. I thought pyramids were supposed to be pointy. You going to split this one up like you did with the gold bar? Sounds like a plan to me. I don't know about you lot, but I reckon it's more exciting this way. That's all well and good, but where are we going to get all the blocks we need to build something so large? I think I can answer that one. Truth is, we thought Jazzy might have something like this, so we came prepared. We didn't just bring one chest full of every the best materials that Crumbledown has to offer. We brought another two in all. Remember that underground temple? Well, we went and nicked the shed load of blocks from it. We can use them to build the pyramid. Oh my god, they like ransacked that temple. I reckon we're about ready to get started. You open, Jazzy? You don't have to if you don't want to. We'll do the uh, fine without you. Up to you, innit? Alright. Pyramid ain't the only thing I have to make, you know? That tablet said something about an oasis, too. Problem is, this place is nothing but sand. How are we supposed to make a lush oasis with uh, loaves of lovely flowers around it if we ain't got no soil to grow them in? Oh, turn that frown upside down, my dear. 
Wherever you get stuck, 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 just call on some but but buddies for your help, like your newfound friends from Furrowfield. You've got got to got a lot on your plate over here, but things will get a lot lot faster with a few extra pans or hands of, to hand help you with. Ugh, I can't talk. I think it's about time you learned how to make a residence register. You can knock 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 one two together at the crafting station. Just place on the ground, ground, ground when you're done. Okay. I ain't too sure how a residence register is going to help us, but I have a feeling we should uh, do what the old fella says. Yeah, the only things I could grab were brazers and grates, but they're able to. Yeah, I think once the story quest is done, you're allowed to take whatever you want from it. But it's fine. I'm happy with it. I'm happy that they're using it for themselves. So what's in here? Damn. Yeah, they really took a lot. All right, let's go over here. Can I upgrade this? Oh, I can. Look at that. Woo wee! Nice. So I got all these good stuff I got from um, Crumbledom. Sweet. Oh. oh, what's all the new stuff then I can make? Let's see. So I can get a sticker, stickler sifter. What the hell's that? Stain extractor. Let's let's unlock all these. I have no idea what half of these things are. I'm just gonna lock them really fast because we have we have the gratitude for it. It is gonna take some time, but thankfully they're they'll they're gonna be doing the work for me, which is nice. Uh, workbench perfor perforated with plethora of holes allows you to specify the shape of connecting parts. I have never heard of these things before. Um, okay, so I got palm lumber. That's cool. Got some sandstone bricks, concrete blocks. Nice, nice. Diamond design blocks. Extract florals, stripy walls. Chintzy block. Oh my god. Stucco? Okay, I got some stucco now. This is copper floor. Sooty silver. Silver tile. Dude, these are nice. Okay, now I got old school wall. Night sky block. Art deco. Oh, gingham. Okay. See, I've definitely gotten a lot more stuff now that I've unlocked uh, metals. Siltstone columns. Oh, look at these cornerstones. Those are cute chains all right so sliding glass door fancy door this is probably part of that modern pack okay glass door i like the fancy door Ooh, stone door mat cast iron door big door big door <laughs> You're surprised and disappointed your bunny suit doesn't come with ears, right? Oh, what's this one? Uh, angled window. Okay. I got some awnings. Nothing new in there. I got some Lincoln lamp. Floor lamp. Table lamp. Wall lamp. Dude, back off. Alright, where was I? I was in lamps. I got the bab sign. I got the fancy light. I love that they're just basically Ikea. I said fuck off! Out of here. Alright, let's see what else I have in here. Uh, basic bunks. Cool. Double beds. Nice, nice. Tartan bed. Ooh, coffee table. Fancy table. Dude, what is with these stupid ants? I'm trying to look at these beds. All right, I got a toasty table. That's kind of cute. Got the bar counters. I still have that comfy sofa. Distinguished deck chair. And I have another chair. Kicking couches, fancy benches, sofa, classy couch. Got a lot of cool stuff. Oh, I got shelves! Sell items on the Island Awakening? I can get shelves? Sleek shelf. 
drawer. How do I sell items? Fancy signpost. All right, what else is here? Price tag. Oh, okay. Let's unlock that. Let's see if we can get some of this stuff. This is the yeah, the modern DLC. So there's like three new DLCs for this game. Um, there's the Hacho pack, there's the Aquarium pack, and then there's the modern pack. And most of these packs aren't supposed to be come out right away, but apparently they just allow you to play it whenever they want, because like nothing's stopping me from building this stuff. Also, instinctively spontaneous. Hello, welcome to the stream. Everybody drop them bears. Thank you for that two-month resub. I'm definitely going to get these. Maybe we could sell stuff. gonna learn these real fast. Oh, that's the residence register. That's something I need to do to make. There you go. Perfect. Um, ooh, frying pans, too. That's pretty good. Brass bracket. Hmm. Uh, potage pot. Yeah, I've learned that one before. Bananas. Celebratory soup. That sounds cute. We need some chicken drumsticks. I got the chickens. Fancy fresh fish platter. <gasps> Plate of pancakes. Omelette spaghetti. Medicine motor. Samurai sword collection. Alarm clock cooking pot. There's so many cute things in here. Look at these high heels. Monster monument. Wait, what's this? Super spouter? Okay. There's a fountain. Marine monument? Okay. So lots of cute stuff in here. Ooh, modern art. Armor sign, shop sign, Hella's hammer sign? Okay. Cooking utensils. Oh my god, there's so many cute- <gasps> Scandalous swimsuit! Build pool of paradise in the Isle of Awakening! Flashy formal wear. Ooh la la. Oh, there's all the minecarts. Photograph fireworks on the Island Awakening. Crash cart. Okay, so there's some cool stuff here. There's some real cool stuff here. All right, let's put some stuff away. Um, all right, let's see. Where's that register at? So I'm pretty sure what I need to do is I need to register Wiggly on my team so I can make like an oasis. Um, where'd it go? <laughs> where'd it go? Um, I definitely made one, right? I have too many items. It would be around here, right? Hella's hammer sign is totally referenced to KOL and Gallimholm. Is that like previous games? Where did that? S I totally made one, correct? Ah, there you are. I see it. I see it. Oop, wrong one. Right there. I'll put it like right here. Boy, Jazzy. Is that the residence register? Have you figured out how to use it? Oh ho ho. She might not know what to do with it, but with that scroll you can move, move, move your pals off to different areas of the island. That's not the only thing that thing you can do, but for now try summoning some of your friends from Furrowfield. Say, Jazzy, any of your mates know a thing or two about soil? We'll need to uh, grow a bit of greenery in the races. Well, s well, that beauty bloke and that nice girl with the face seem pretty keen on giving us a hand. Reckon you can get them over? <laughs> That's decided. We'll bring over um, Wrigley, Rosie, and Bonanzo. Okay. Okay, so I have to remove from party. Oh, I can't choose that yet? Relocate. Oh, okay. Hey guys. I knew you lot would be able to manage without me. After all, I taught the builder everything she knows. Hello, Gimbats. I'm so uh, glad you invited me over. I hope we had a chance to work together since that moment you stepped off the boat. Yoo-hoo, Rosie, Wrigley, Bonanzo. What brings you three over here? Jazzy sent out the call for help. She, she did. I hear you're making an oasis, and you'll need some soil for that. I reckon I can help you out with that. 
and Rosie and I shall lend your considerable skills to the construction of the spectacular pyramid. Many ha hands make light the work, so they say. By the way, if you need more help, I don't expect Perry and Brittany and Lillian are too busy. Maybe they can come over as well. All right, let's go invite everybody. Okay. Oh, Jazzy, I forgot to tell you. Do you remember that chicken you brought back with Perry? Well, she's been very busy hen, clucking around and laying lots of lovely eggs. Thanks. You should try cooking them. They make a great little snack when you're peckish. Thanks for roping in a few more recruits to help. Build the pyramid, Jazzy. They'll start running a lot smoother now. Ho ho ho! Your friends may hail from different lands, but they... That won't stop, stop, stop them from working together. Builders the world over long have dreamed a land where everyone and their hands are so I hear. I hope you use the resident resident to the full potential to keep everyone busy. Speaking of keeping busy, reckon you can help Wrigley with the Oasis? I'm going to crack with, with, on with the pyramid. Once you're done with that, you can either lend us a hand or with, with the pyramid, or even better, build some logins, logins where we all can take a well-earned rest. All right, there's a letter for me. Let's see now. What goes into making an oasis? Well, at the very least, we shall need some water and greenery. Now then, Jazzy, I spotted several dried up ponds in this vicinity. I could tell you where they are and the palm trees that still grow there. There's one in particular that I believe would be the most excellent oasis. It's just behind those mini uh, missionaries are lurking. Ah. First, you'll need to fill the basin with water, which I can definitely do. And once you got that leaking wet, I'll work my warming way over there to the banks and to make it nice and green. All right. Easy. Easy. Done. Just so you know, sand and soil ain't got the nutrients in them, so the greeny what grows around stuff aren't going to be the same stuff back on Furrowfield. Can't wait to see what grows around our new oasis. Fill up with, uh, the bed with water, plop a few warm balls, we'll have it look lime and brilliant. One more thing. If you want to dig a bit deeper into the secrets of oasis making, just come and have a chat with me, alright? Alright, everybody get to work. Get out of here. Um, yeah, let's relocate them here. Make it easier. We can always uh, send them back. Yeah, we can always send them back to their, their town. Alright, let's make some more... Um, let's make some more worm food. Actually, let's make some more of these first. Oh, I need more poop. All right, let's go get more poop. Oops, I always do that. Nope, it's how you leave the game. Typical hermit, slightly brain, brain fried. Is that typical? Let's get some more of that poop. I need to make um, one of those bells for this area. Picking up their gratitude is so annoying. Well, now we can also feed the dogs, though, which is nice. I have a ton of meat. Yeah, I have a ton of meat. Uh, place... I do, like, 17? Put some in here as well. Sort of like where they hang out. Do like 10? There we go. Now my puppies have food! Alright, uh, pooper. Woo! Wow! 27 of that. Jesus Christ. Oh, my puppy's finally eating! I love it! Go eat, puppy! I'm gonna watch this dog eat. Yeah, they love the food! Aw, they're so cute. Oh yeah, have you guys seen my new uh, Japanese spa? I made this. Now that I actually can make a, a bar, I'm gonna make this into a really fancy little, like, spa resort area. It's fancy. Super fancy. It's got a nice little pool in the back. It's great. Alright. Um, 
Let's go back to here. It's a fancy spa. Alright, let's make some more poop. Worm food. We're gonna make a couple more trees. And then we're just gonna make the rest into worm food. Beat it, you stupid. Out of here. Alright. So this is where we need to fill the water in. There we go. I guess we'll start here. My place looks amazing, right? It's so cute, Tanj. It's so adorable. I love this game. I have a feeling this is going to be very much like Minecraft. Might have to build out a bit in order to get this uh, properly filled in. Make lots of water complete. Oh, -ho, another com challenge complete. I see. Crack, crack, cracking job. Well, wouldn't you look at that? It's a mini metal. Just eight more tablets. So I give you the magic pencil. Toodle pip. Eat it, rat. Oh. Oops. Gotta get just right. Rat's gonna drown. Basically, yeah. Yeah, he's gonna drown. Alright, so... I'm already seeing a problem here. I kind of like the idea that these are like little tiny like mini waterfalls, but like I feel like I need to really do something about this water. Beat it, ants. There we go. We're getting this all filled. Dude, rat. You messed with the wrong person, rat. So we got that part side. Let's go over here now. Alright, so we're on that layer. Let's get some, um... Maybe some sand blocks. I ain't playing with you, rat. There's a cave. There's a cave in the oasis. I'll have to look for it. Alright, so we kind of want it to be on that level. So... Wrong button, wrong button, wrong button. We'll play this in a couple days. Clearly tell. Beautiful. I think one more here. There you go. 
It's a matter of preference, yeah. Definitely. I am being one of a. I, my, my, my idea of a perfect island is having a perfect oasis. I, I mean, it is boring watch, but whatever. It's what is. It's better than having, like, a half built oasis. Are you guys done over there? Because I would really like you guys to start phase two. It's like 99% done. What's the other part that's not done? Oh, just a couple mud brick walls? Is that really it? Oh, okay. I wonder if I have to put these down first before they start doing more. So let's do that real fast. Excuse me, gentlemen. There's a zombie! Wait. Excuse me! Y'all wanna rumble? stuff Look at these moles. What rude gusses. Like we'll put holes in everything you own. All right, there's one more on this island. There you are. Come here, you. There we go. Is that all of them? Okay. Kind of like the idea of having this one be like tropical. Right here. Let's put down one of these um, forest ones. Alright. Are you guys done yet? Still at 99%. Like, I see you guys got the walls. You got the blocks, but you're just not doing it fast enough. Alright, we'll keep working on this. Let's see, let's go here. Let's go here. Oh, I'm out. <laughs> That's only the first floor, yeah. They have like two more phases to go. I'm just wondering if I can get them to go a little faster. Right, Wrigley's doing this thing. Dead. So who was supposed to be in charge of helping me with the oasis? Was it Lulu? There it is. Now it's complete. Ba -da 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 -da. This is going to be a big pyramid. Oh my days. Have you seen Jazz? The first stage of the pyramid's finished. We did it. We mustn't rest on our laurels, but I have a funny feeling that when it's uh, complete, this pyramid will be a truly spectacular. We can barely wait to the, see the finished thing. It might explode from excitement. All right, let's get to phase two. Once the peak of the pyramid is placed, people will come from uh, in their droves to have a chef. Shefty. Tell you what, if you're uh, at a bar nearby, we'll make a killing. Maybe the tourist trade. They'll come for the pyramid, stay for the jiggers. This chap certainly has a sharp eye for sale. What'd you say, Jazzy? I knew there was something unusual about him. I thought it was just the mustache. I must admit, I'm rather in awe of our new arrivals. They built this massive monument in mere moments. Well, it ain't like this is the first thing we've ever made. We've helped build the gold bar, you know. And that place was, well, glitzy. An enormous glittering gold bar? How wonderful. I can't wait to see my first royal visit to Crumbledom. 
We'll be honored to have you, Your Majesty. If you're glitz and glamour, you'll love our mates Goldilocks and Jules. They're the fanciest fellows around. What's with the worm in the hat? He makes green grass. He's, his name is Wrigley and he's the best. Uh, hello guys. Watching you build was a real jam, man. The blocks went down with the slam, man. It was like magic alakazam, man. You got a vision, real ambition. I think I want to be a builder too. The real thing, not a sham. But sadly, there's another island we gotta go be at. Orders from the man, man. Hey Jazzy, these dudes and dudettes can lay down this island like all they like, but as far as I'm concerned around here, you're the man, man. Might be missionaries from the children of Argon, but we won't be forced we won't force you to believe. We respect your freedom. Now we gotta scram. Peace. Weirdos. What did they, what did they even come here for? Maybe they're telling the truth. Maybe not everyone of the children of Argon is as bad as they say. Well, I for one don't trust them an inch. As far as I'm concerned, they're evil and they always will be. Let's not waste our breath talking about them any longer. We have a py pyramid to complete. Perfectly honest, I'm rather relieved to see the back, uh, the back of those mysterious missionaries. But sure enough, there was work to be done. Would you be kindly draft a design for the second, second section of the pyramid? It's time for you to work your magic. We can't begin without a blueprint, you know. Let's go. Let's go. Second part of the pyramid. <laughs> All right, get to work, guys. Get to work. Nice one. It's another masterpiece, isn't it? All righty, I get to feel ready to feel the burn in my biceps from pushing blocks on this blueprint. Let's get cracking then. I hope you lads have uh, lasses have done your warm-ups. Looks like we still have enough materials left to build this blueprint too, so we can leave this place in our capable hands. By the way, when you got a sec, I gotta ask you a favor. Alright. What up, dude? Oh god, I don't want to talk to you, Lulu. About that favor, the pyramid's coming along nicely, but ain't it looking a bit sparse on the inside? I reckon it could do with a couple of bedrooms or something to live in to liven the place up, but... I ain't interested in no normal rooms. I want you to make rough and tough bedroom, a neat and sweet bedroom. The rough and tough bedroom will need a bed, a light source, and bottles and dumbbells. <laughs> and the fancy schmancy one will need a bare chair, light source, and a dressing table, a pot plant, and a resident sign. As for what you make the walls out of, that's entirely up to you. All right, rough and tough and sweet, neat and sweet. How do you make a pot plant? If not, maybe you can get an inspiration from that crafting station of yours. All right, I could do this. I could do this. Rough and tough. Brittany obviously needs a rough and tough one. She's got to keep her uh, physique up. All right, guys, collect all this good stuff. Oh, like the last holdout. This little piece right here. There we go. Got there. We got there. Let's break that. Let's clean up our mess. And now we've got ourselves a beautiful oasis. Scorpion. What are you trying to do, Scorpion? You're not going to get anywhere. I'm too fast. You stay out of that water. Yeah, alright, we did it. Wish there was an easy way of collecting all this crap. There we go. Like, you stay down there, buddy. I don't need any- I don't need you. I don't need you to come up here. There we go. Done. This is not bad. 
Um, can I make any more, um, grass blocks? Worm food? Let's see. Worm food. I can only make. Oh, yeah, I can make. Quick more. Okay. 